going. Be respectful. We just mop the floor. I am humbled by my king's confidence. Spare me your empty attitude. Apologies, my queen. I meant no offense. I know what you meant. Do not blame me for your food. You are not the first to claim they have captured a Taratara. You, you doubt its authenticity? If it is what you say it is, prove it. Or suffer the consequence of every other would-be con artist. I assure you, I say, milady. release it. We got this. Bring in the next seller and transfer 10,000 units to that last one's next of you. Speak. Hey there, I'm Star Lord. Okay. Drax the Destroyer. <laughs> the undoing of the Mad Titan in the flesh. And such flesh. Your presence honors me. You are much smaller than I expected. Oh? <laughs> and what were you expecting? Perhaps I can do something about it. But uh, unlikely. We'll see, Destroyer. I can be quite forceful. believe she is flirting with me. Play along, man. Flatter her or something. You got this. Just for the best. Your negotiation skills are terrible. Lady Hellbender. I can see by the size of your weapon that you must be a skillful warrior. Hmm. Perhaps I can give you a demonstration sometime. You 
would make an acceptable opponent. Tell me, Destroyer, what brings you to Sagnarf 9? Peter Quill, show her the creature. Your kind had been wiped out. Name your terms, Destroyer. Twenty thousand units. Twenty thousand? The creature is not monstrous like the creepy little beast. But it is a capable warrior and it possesses regenerative qualities. Also, it is the last of its species. Twenty thousand units is sufficient compensation. No. No? What do you mean, no? <sighs> I mean... No. Well, then you're an idiot, lady. Groot, he's the best monster you could buy. Either you pay us what he's worth. Rocket Drax has this. Name your terms, then. Fifteen thousand. And you stay. Whoa, you wanna buy Drax? Not buy. Invest. I could use a warrior like you at my side. I have other commitments. Shame. <laughs> we could have had such fun together. Twelve thousand for the Flora Colossus, then. Twelve thousand is not Not nearly. that bad for a Flora... whatever deal. 12,000 units it is. The storms of Seknoff grow ravenous. You will stay among my Hellraisers and revel as one of us. Yeah, this is great. We'd be. Thank you. Flirting with a Sagnarfian beast handler. Who confirmed that Groot is definitely probably being kept in the new additions pen. Which is where exactly? Well, we didn't quite get that far. Good thing we're doing my plan. Tracker's pointing back to Lady Skull Suit's throne room, so uh, that's where I'm going. Tiny little problem. Boy, when these guys go, they go hard. Heavily inebriated. Doesn't mean they're not a threat. Some of my best blade work happens after I've had a few. If a few scut knuckles gotta die to save Groot, so be it. Whoa, whoa, hey! We are not here to start a war with the woman who's got her own private army. No, it doesn't rob her. If we do things right and be quiet, we'll be in and out with no one the wiser. Drax, what part of quiet don't you understand? Dead is quiet, Peter Quill. No killing! Don't touch anything, don't step on anything, and don't break anything. Don't do anything stupid. If we mess this up, it's game over for crew. And us. Gotta hand it to the lady. She knows how to throw a party. It was like this with the Ravagers, too. Yondu was a real work hard, play hard sort. Thanos doing either usually ended up with murder. We compare in Scotty father figures because mine gave me a shock collar for my birthday. Once we did. 
ditch this place, I will show you guys a real party. Ah, I will construct festive headwear worthy of this celebration. Throne room entrance is down there, so we just gotta, you know, leap our way across the chasm quietly. Gotta say, this is not what I had in mind when you pitched this whole hero for hire thing. Maybe Hellbender will give you a job. I'm not the one she was interested in. <laughs> She's right. We should have just sold Drax. That's not what I said. Maybe next time we're in Hawaii, we can auction off a date with Drax. Katathians do not date. We perform feats of virility and are judged worthy. Or not. That how you ended up with your wife? Ulan was the most proficient killer in our village. Her affections were sought after all the most. Sounds like my kind of woman. That's it. Dead ahead. Past another bunch of lightweights. You're sure that tracker of yours is reliable? Trust me, this baby's paid for itself. Oh, you actually paid for it? Paid, stolen, such thing. I trust Rocket's doodad. Remember that time on Ansara? <laughs> I remember no such time. Before your days, Muscles, Quill got caught stealing eggs from this place on Sakaar. Why am I not surprised? My doodad led me straight to him, hiding in a spike hatchery. Do your magic, Rocket. It is not magic. Just saying, have a little faith, Woolberry. My tech built them thumpers, it's gonna pop this door, and it'll find Groot. Am I good, or am I good? Those were the same options. Okay, Tracker says... Ah, come on, you skeg. I knew that thing was junk. Look, we saw him take Groot down the elevator, right? So we just gotta find the controls. Lady Ladi does probably got him on her fancy chair up there. We are down here. Hellbender used some sort of rising stairs. There's gotta be a way of activating them from ground level. Maybe there's some stairs. There are several stairs. I mean stairs down. Drax, think you could lift this thing? Easily. What do you want me to do with it? Still working on that. Can't you just do that flippy thing and get up there, Gamora? Even I've got my limits. What is your maximum altitude? There's definitely something up there. Hmm. The chair is wired. The actuator for the stairs is probably not far away. Of course she can't just have a normal freaking ground level chair. It's intended to inspire fear in her adversaries. It's a crime of efficiency is what it is. Doesn't look too comfortable either. Maybe there's a control panel inside there you can hack. It's possible. All right, Drax, try to clear that rubble. At once. Let's see what's hiding back there. Think you could have made more noise with that? Of course, but you did not ask. All right, I'm sending the schematic to your visor. Just follow the wiring and tell me which junctions to switch. Uh, here? Done. Whoops! Must be setting our soothing sounds, Volume 2. I believe those are monster mating calls. Okay, that's a little freaky. Switch this! Done. This one. Oh, here! Yep. Okay, here. Rocket, did that work? It's half powered, but I don't got enough juice to flip the circuit yet. There's gotta be a second node. Okay. And you uh, Peter? Close it, close it, close it! Close what? Hey! Hey! We've got company! Captain! Is killing permitted now, Peter Quill? Yes, now! Kill them now! I prefer confrontation to some of you! You don't strike me as a stealthy sword! Think these guys will be missed? What the few henchmen? 
Another Hellraiser defeated! Oh man, you laid that space there, Cal! Well, that was not ideal. Hey, no witnesses, no problem. Maybe Hellbender won't miss them. Switch this. Done. This what one. What the was that? Uh, just a little slip. No big deal. For all we know, you may have just reconfigured the entire fortress. Nah. Probably just lowered a height a bit or something. There, keep it like that. I can get up to the throne now. You better hope that panel actually works, because I'm out of things to tinker with down here. Of course it'll work. See? Nailed it! That is the wrong elevator. What? He's right. Groot went down on the other side. Well, it's the only one we got, sweetheart. Call me sweetheart again. Uh, I'm sure they both lead to the same place. Your voice does not convey certainty. I'm mostly sure. This is it. We're almost there. I gotta say, this is going pretty smooth. It has been considerably less than smooth. Okay, yeah, we had that one kink, but at least no one raised the alarm. That's what you call a kink? It'll be smooth sailing from here. What the piece of scut? Right on cue. It's not that. Something's wrong. Heads up, more guards. I would give a wide berth, Peter Quill. Oh, come on, you hunk of chunk. Flark! Anyone else got a bad feeling all of a sudden? Rocket, keep it down. Stuff it, Quill. Groot's tracker just went dark. You said we're almost there. I'm sure he's fine. You ain't sure a scut. Groot! That could have gone better. Could have gone worse. At least he didn't wake anyone on his way. Rogan has tiny padded feet. Is it possible that Broden would leave without us after freeing the tree? No, he wouldn't. Maybe we should hurry up. Rocket, wait for us! He did not wait. Thanks, Drax. With this place and no railings. It's like they got the architect from the Death Star. I am not familiar with that installation. We should probably split up. Door's locked. How exactly are we supposed to get out of here? I'm working on a plan. What plan? So far, we don't go that way. What the 
heck is that? It's my spirit animal. Strong. Definitely not a fan of whatever this is. This creature is grotesque. Yuck. Just yuck. It's like the Flarkin Collectors Museum all over again. At least these beasts seem well cared for. Prisons of prison. Rocky, we found him! Over here! Brute! Easy there, bud. I'll get you out in a flash. Whoa! Hey, let's not turn him into kindling. Stand back. I will breach the perimeter. It's too thick. It's too thick. Who knew? That's it. Just like the Urago drop, bud. On three, two... Last witch stripped you down to your bark. You know, we'd have showed up sooner, but I twinkled the toes. Good to have you back, Root. Now all we need is an exit. Uh, I guess Groot knows the way. Hey, wait up, bud. What's going on? Say something. You okay, Groot? Shut it, Quill. What did I do? You're the one who insisted on this stupid plan. Now that freaking monster queen has... I don't know. Traumatized him. Exactly. Is that it, big guy? Are you hurt? Come on, big guy. Don't just clam up. I told you, it should have been me in that box. Okay, this door was definitely locked before. Perhaps the tree has been bewitched. She did do something to that guy, huh? So no one's gonna talk about the fact that he's walking around naked. Come on, talk to me, boy. What did that Badoon Flarka do to you? Oh, crap. Guardians of the Galaxy. You fools thought you could cheat me and suffer no consequence. Groot. <laughs> Which one of you thought it wise to entrust your absurd scheme to a Flora Colossus? You call him friend. Yet you ignore his very nature, overlooking the fact that he is... The worst liar in history. I told you, he can't just pretend to be monstrous. To his credit, he kept your secret for almost an hour. Lady Hellbender, let us settle this honorably. I will face you in combat. Honorably? Your offer is worthless, Destroyer. There is no escaping my wrath! I can work with that. Dweller! Feast upon them! True monster! Well, let's make it truly dead! Now we know what kind of monster Hellbender likes! Little late for that! I'm on it! What does she 
defeat this Great thing! Point. No doubt the flesh of its enemies! Don't let it heal, Quill! What? Pay for that! Do it, 
Don't you, Rocket? Take heed of the explosive, Peter Quill! Guys, huddle up! Why'd you call us in, Peter? I, for one, am doing great out there. As am I, Assassin. So perhaps he wants you out of my way. Or maybe he wants you to sit back and watch so you can learn from a pro. Have each other's backs out there. No one's winning this on their own. Precisely. But if we stay united and centered, there will be no turning back. Who's with me? I am with you, Peter. Let's do this! Great! Your own weapon shall be your downfall! That thing must get killer, Hartford! That seems unlikely! The boom ball! Been too long since I've closed something up! The explosive could be useful if cool! Oh, man! Why are you playing? I'm not sure! Kick their butt! An awful mistake. And an awful amount of cash. There is no escaping Lady Hellbender's wrath. We'll see about that. What the? Mine, Guardian. 